to my channel if you are new um, in today's video um, I'm so excited because um, I am showing you my makeup vanity slash collection um, so this is my vanity you'll see it better when I actually show you um, but yeah I got this with my graduation money um, I'll link it down in the description so if you want to get the same thing then you can um, I did go on Ikea to buy everything um, because this was not the planned setup I had in mind um, but Ikea shipping was over $200 also if you hear in the back my dog is just like laying on my bed he's just chilling and sometimes he'll make like little snorting noises <laughs> but anyways besides Besides that, um, yes, I am very, very grateful for this um, area. Um, makeup has been a part of my life ever since like I was a little girl. So Okay, I had to let my dog out of the room because he was kind of growling. Um, but anyways, yes, I have been wanting a setup like this for a very, very long time. It's been one of my dreams for so long. And the fact that like this is in my room, like this is my area to do my makeup. Um, I have so much leg room to move around in and I just feel like I'm finally like getting my dream room. I know it sounds stupid, but um, I'm like getting chills right now. I don't know why, but I am so, so grateful. I cannot say it enough. Um, this area is going to be my happy place and I can't wait to show you guys everything on the vanity. I made it really, really cute um, and I hope you guys enjoy. Um, let me know what videos you want to see um, and yeah, let's just hop on into the video because I'm so excited, okay? <laughs> So starting off from the far left hand corner, I have this beautiful plant. I picked it out myself. Um, she's cute. I have been growing her. Um, you move over and here is my little um, mirror that I get ready with. It's one of those um, ones that you can flip and it looks, you look like an alien. <laughs> um, but anyways, um, then I have my Starbucks cup. This is unfortunately not, it's plastic basically, but I have been reusing it for like a week. And then I of course have my reusable straw. Um, and then over here is my um, makeup brushes. So I have it in this little glass container and it has all of my scrunchies right here. Um, I just keep them there that in case I just wanna pull my hair back. Um, and then I have, yeah, all of my brushes. I don't have that much, but I have enough um, just for myself. So you move over and there's this empty area. Um, and here is a drawer, but I haven't put anything in it yet because I do not have that much makeup. Um, but maybe I can do one next year and I'll have these filled, hopefully, hopefully. Um, down there is just a little trash can that doesn't matter at all. Um, you move along and why am I out of breath? <laughs> um, so you can see I have a string of Christmas lights over the whole entire vanity um, and it comes up around here. Um, I just love the touch and it just really adds a lot and what else was I can say? It's really pretty outside right now. Um, but um, at night, it's so, so gorgeous just laying in your bed, having all of the lights off, and then just these. It is so like aesthetic, I love it. Um, but you move along, here is another drawer. Again, there's nothing in those drawers. Um, here is my Mac computer where all the magic happens, aka me being up on my on YouTube at 2 in the morning watching ASMR videos um, <laughs> let me know if you guys want an ASMR video because I've been thinking of doing one but I know everyone doesn't like it but anyways yeah um, I edit my videos on here and I paid for it all on my own so I'm kind of proud of that um, Right here is a lamp, and I just really like the geometric shapes. I did a haul of it like a long time ago, I think in 2017. Okay, that's only two years ago, but um, underneath it, I do not want to move it right now. There's a hole 
where like an open hole where you can put in cords so I can plug in my computer over here when I get ready um, it's really really nice and convenient and then you move on to the really really exciting part um, which is these drawers now these look like the Alex 9 drawers but they're actually a dupe and they're only seven drawers um, and on top of the drawers I have this nice like little tin tray that has a pair of sunglasses um, my Marc Jacobs Daisy perfume which smells amazing if you want to know how I smell this is like how I smell like this is just my signature scent I love it so much um, and then gotta say stay sanitized um, so yeah I just have one of these I have a candle which flavor not flavor scent is it orange and cedarwood it smells really good so moving on let's get into the first drawer so the first drawer this as you can see is all of my skincare if it wants to focus come on okay there we go so we have my um, Cetaphil or Cetaphil I don't know how you say it but um, daily facial cleanser I have another facial cleanser this is a bamboo charcoal one um, I love this one so much um, these I love Myriad if you couldn't tell this is a rapid relief acne spot treatment and another spot treatment um, I have a clarifying mask I have this little um, tester by Glam Glow this is just a little <laughs> another spot treatment um so yeah this is my skincare and just like yeah hair care just everything along those lines so i have a nail clipper i have a little chapstick i have i think what is it is this another spot treatment okay amanda's addicted to spot treatments um i have this little card that says make your heart happy and your skin will glow I love that so much. That's so cute. I'm going to put that down there right there. Er, <laughs> I'm going to just set that there. Um, since I have really oily skin, I love buying blotting sheets. Um, and so yeah, I just have these e.l.f. blotting sheets. Um, and then under here is just some aloe um, makeup remover wipes. Um, yeah, my grandma gave it to me because she had some extras in the hotel room. So... Um, and then back here is my love, my joy, my Neutrogena face, um, yeah, like my, uh, what is it? I cannot think. My face removing wipes? I don't know. Why can I not think of that? Um, and then back here, I don't know if the lighting's gonna be the best, I'm sorry, um, but I have these little tester lotions, shampoo, conditioner, and then I have aloe vera, I have this Morphe um, eye primer, I have this Smashbox photo finish, um, what is it like primer yeah so I haven't used these samples yet but oh yeah and then back here is this is if I want to apply face masks so I don't have to do it with my hands I can just apply it with this cool little brush I just got it in a face mask set and like from Walmart or something and so yeah <laughs> look at me doing ASMR <laughs> okay so that's all in the first drawer and the second drawer um, is more makeup so let me yeah, there we go. So back here is my two different Morphe palettes. They're just stacked against each other. It's the Morphe 3502 and the Morphe 35B palette. Um, if it'll focus. Okay, and then right here is the ColourPop Yes Please palette. I love this palette so, 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 so much. Um, and then um, I also have this Tarte Park Avenue Princess. Um, bronzing and contouring palette and then I also have the Too Faced Peach palette. I love this palette so much. This is the first palette that really got me into makeup. Um, so yeah, this one is really loved. The, mag the magnetation is even like a little broken on that one but still love her. Um, and then over here is lip products so I have two lip liners from MAC I have it in the shade spice and sore um, 
I love these lip liners. MAC always comes through. Um, this lipstick, this liquid lipstick, is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. It is in the shade Naked. I have some Kylie glosses. I think this is Cupcake. I do not remember what this one was called. But this one is pretty much gone, but I still keep it. And then I also have this e.l.f. liquid lipstick in the shade Praline. Um, next, I have this Jeffree Star um, lipstick. It is in the shade... Come on, focus. Mm, Queen Supreme. I know you guys can't see it. I don't know why it's focusing. I'm so sorry. But yeah, I love this so much. Um, yeah. And then next I have a MAC lipstick in the shade Velvet Teddy. Um, let me take this off for you for a second. So then you can see it. Look at her. She's cute. Um, this is so hard to do with one hand. Like, wow. I have a Too Faced Melted Matte Lipstick. I love these so much. And this is in the shade Lady Balls. So, yeah. I love that one so much. And then, back here is some more lip products. So, right here I have the Too Faced Peach Lip Scrub. If it wants to focus. Excuse me. Like, you are being very rude right now. Um, and then, this is the Too Faced peach lip balm it actually tastes like peaches it is amazing there we go it's finally focused so yeah here's the lip balm and then here is the lip scrub so I love them so much um, and then this is a mirror that my friend got me when she went to oh my goodness where did she go <gasps> Oh my goodness, I am like blanking, but it was in Europe, so um, she got me this really, really cool mirror, and I just, I love it so much. Back here is some tape, so then if I want to do an extravagant eyeshadow look, I can make sure I have um, a clean line, so tape really helps with that. Um, I have some bobby pins, and then I have these like eyebrow slash eyelash brushes. Yeah, that's what's in that drawer. Let's go to the next drawer, which we have a lot of stuff in here. So let's just start from the left and move on. So right here I have my Benefit Professional Primer. I have my Fenty Beauty um, Foundation. Um, what shade is this in? This is in the shade... Um, it looks like in 120. I don't know if you guys can see this, but underneath here is a Clinique um, foundation that I haven't tried out. Just a little tester. Um, and then this is the foundation I pretty much use in all of my makeup looks. It is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation in the shade... What shade is this? This is in the shade 110. Again, I know it's not focusing that well. And then my favorite concealer is the ColourPop No Filter Concealer in, well, I'm in the shade 08. Um, but yeah, they have a lot of, they just have a big shade range. Um, next, I have two of these NYX Matte Finish, just finish setting sprays. So yeah, I love NYX so much. Um, so yeah, um, back there, I don't know if you can really see, but I have a Milani blush. Let me actually just grab it. Um, in Luminoso. Um, I love this blush so much. And you can get it from the drugstore. Drugstore is like hooking it up. Go to the drugstore. Um, and if you can find a dupe for expensive products, I'd recommend doing that. Um, I've had this bronzer for a very long time. But... Um, yeah, I use it sometimes. I used it a little bit today. Um, this is the, oh, I cannot open it, Hula um, Bronzer by Benefit. Yeah, it's like, I really hit pan on this one. Um, so let's put it back there. Um, and then I have a dirty, crusty beauty blender. Let's not talk about it. And then um, this other beauty blender, which is the same one as that. Like, wow, she had a glow up. But this is the Real Technique um, beauty blender. Love her. Um, so I still use the, okay, so let's just run down. So for powders, this is the powder I use. This is the Makeup Revolution um, Translucent Powder, but from time and time on, from, <laughs> I cannot talk, um, from time to time I will open this cap and put it in here um, just because this 
like if you open it and try to put it on your face then the powder will go everywhere and it's just a lot better if I put it into here so um, back there I don't know if you can see this um, this is also a setting powder I have oh I cannot pick it up um, this is the Maybelline fit me um, powder in the shade 120 so yeah nothing too exciting um, what else um, if we move along, I'm sorry, this is kind of messy, but, um, I have this Benefit, what is it called? Benefit, precisely my brow pencil, I love this brow pencil, um, this is the mini version, um, yeah, it's just, and I got it in the shade 3.5, I loved using this, but it's pretty much gone, so, um, but if I wanted to pick up another one, I just keep it in there, and this is the eyebrow pencil I use every day, um, this is the NYX micro brow pencil in the shade taupe, um, I'm always in the shade taupe for, um, brow pencils, so, yeah, pretty cool with that, um, and then I have more NYX. This is the Super Skinny, if it'll want to focus. Come on, what is my camera doing today? Okay, this is the NYX um, Super Skinny Eyeliner. Um, I don't use it that much because it pretty much drawed, or drew, ugh, it pretty much dried out. But if I kind of want to make an outline to put on this eyeliner, that's what I do. So this is just the e.l.f black eyeliner I don't know um, I love this eyeliner so so much and it's only like three dollars and so I'd highly highly recommend that one it just comes out super black and I love it actually let's go on and go back here so this is also a Maybelline highlighter um, if you can see I have a cotton round over it because I traveled with this when I went to New York. This is the highlighter I used. It is not wanting to open for me. Just wait a second. So I don't really know. I don't know what that pink thing is. Um, but when I did use this, um, I loved it so much. It is just so gorgeous. So yeah, it's a holographic highlighter. So if you want to do an alien look or something, um, you could definitely do that. But this is the highlighter that I use every single day or whenever I'm wearing makeup. Um, this is the Anastasia X Amrezy highlighter. It is the most gorgeous highlighter. In existence I love this I don't think you can buy it anymore which is so sad um, and I don't know what I'm gonna do after this is gone like I seriously don't know what I'm gonna do because this packaging the highlighter the pigmentation is just yeah I love it so much so down here are my mascaras let me get a different angle so this is what is it these are all Maybelline um, mascaras um, this is the Colossal Volume, these are the Great Lash, and yeah, this, so then you move on to more lash stuff. So, um, this is some eyelash glue, it's nothing too special, but I love this one. This is by Kiss, and then down here, I just have individual, or no, never mind. I don't know where that other eyelash went, but um, I'm meaning to get more eyelashes. There's another pair <laughs> that I didn't put back in here. Um, but back here I have some scissors so I can cut my lashes. I have an eyelash curler. I have some more individual lashes, um, a lash box, um, some, what are those called? I do not remember what they're called. When I'm editing this, I'll remember. <laughs> But then back here, I don't use this this or too often, but this ooh, is an Urban Decay. What are these even called? These are called, um, it's in the shade Solstice. It's just like um, a kind of a glitter, a press on glitter, but it looks like it's about to break. So I really do not want to open that right now. Um, so yeah, that's everything in that drawer. Um, I don't think I have anything in these drawers. Nope, I don't have anything in that drawer or this drawer, but I definitely have some stuff in this drawer. Um, 
so I have my curlers my straightener it's kind of just a tangled mess um, and then this is the box that my perfume came in um, this is my dry shampoo that I use pretty often um, I'd highly recommend it it smells actually so good it unfortunately comes out white but since I have blonde hair it doesn't bother me that much but if you have darker hair maybe this isn't for you but yeah I love it it's just yeah it's really good so um, then I have this lotion which is this Bath and Body Works vanilla bean Noel lotion or body cream and then this other one which is a thousand wishes this one smells so freaking good I love it so much so highly recommend and then going on to the last drawer which is a lot of stuff so this is something that I have just painted um, recently it's um, inspired by Tyler the creator flower boy album um, so love her um, this was the instructions to put these drawers together and then this is kind of just my artsy yeah, my artsy whatever I need to grab down here. So here's a lot of paintbrushes. Here's some flowers for some makeup looks I have done. If you want to go follow me, I am going to peep my Instagram, which is moi makeup with two H's. Um, so again, moi makeup two H's. Um, I used those. I don't know if you can see, but down here I have some flowers I've used these. Um, and then I have paints. I have stickers down here. I have some boxes, I just have a lot of stuff. Um, this is some 21 Pilot stuff, some ticket stuff. Um, and yeah, so let's put this back into here. Um, so it's somewhat organized and I'm just so happy I have an area for everything. So let's do another overview of everything. So here we go again, this is my vanity area again oh and I have this pink rug it's really dirty but I got it from Target Target always just hooks it up with everything um, and it matches my lamp so that is what the drawers look like um, okay this is gonna be really messy really quick but that's where I plug in everything um, and then I can watch TV um, while I'm sitting down or do my computer like, I mean, like, watch videos on my computer. Um, so, yeah, I am just really happy with how it looks. Um, it's just my little area, and then I can look out the window and see all of the trees. Um, it's so pretty. I'm going to just show you really quick. Yeah, I can just look outside while doing my makeup. It is so calming. I just love the energy. I eventually want to get a salt lamp for this little area. Um, but I'm just really happy with how it looks so far. So I'm really happy um, with my setup. I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing inside these drawers, get a feel of what everything looks like. Again, I don't have like the most makeup as all of these makeup collection videos, but I do not care. Like I am so happy with what I have. I am so grateful that I can organize everything and even this little tray that has this candle is so so cute with my little perfume actually let's spray some on right now okay so yeah oh this is so cute so oh this smells so good i can't get over it um so that was my makeup vanity slash collection i really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video let me know down below um what else you want to see because i am definitely filming a lot more in this little area um actually it's a big area now so i am just really hyped um again i'm just so grateful and thankful um and yeah i hope you guys have a really good day or you have had a good day um if you want to look um at my old makeup collection i think i filmed it like a year and a half ago i don't know it was a long time ago but i'll link it down in the description so you guys can watch that um and yeah subscribe go follow my makeup ig Go follow my makeup Twitter. They're just both moi makeup with two H's. Um, and I think that's all I have to say. 
Um, and oh, I don't know. It's just crazy. I've, I've been dreaming of this for so long and it's actually here and I'm actually the person doing the makeup collection video. Okay, I'm going to stop rambling. Um, I'm going to make myself popcorn, watch some more Hunger Games um, because <laughs> that's what I was watching while I was getting ready and I am going to go edit this video. Uh, I love you guys so much. Thank you for all of your support. It seriously means the world to me. I love you. I love you. I love you. Um, and until next time, I will see you in my next video. Bye. See you on Monday because that's when I'm filming. Monday and Friday. Okay, I'm going to go. Okay, bye.